welcome to the spooky little house witch i am your host raven and today i wanted to show you guys some of the things that i've got from home goods slash tj maxx so for our location the two stores are right next to each other they actually share the same interior so it just has a sign halfway through that changes so i kind of didn't really keep track of which side i got it from but it's basically the same store so without further ado let's jump in so the very first item is actually what you are looking at so i got this tablecloth the scary creepy cloth was not obviously a part of it i thought this was the cutest little tablecloth they had a bunch of them there as i'm sure everyone has seen in various other videos here is what the packaging looks like so it's supposed to be water resistant, which is really nice, especially for a like actual table that you're going to be using. But this is the hats and pumpkins one, and this was $12.99. Now, unfortunately for us, they did not have the round in stock, and they only had one of these, so we got the oblong, and it just doesn't fit our table exact. Next, I know not everyone loves Ray Dunn. You either kind of love it, indifferent, or you absolutely hate it. I think it's super cute and quirky, so I got quite a few things. The first is this beautiful Witch's Brew sign. It's just very simple. It has a super adorable little cauldron and then it just says witch's brew and it's just got this wood background and on the top they have this sticker that I'm sure is gonna be a pain to get off and then this was $9.99 the next item is from this brand called Coco and Lola currently I'm not like really big on the names you really just hear about Ray Dunn but they had this little ghosty bowl and I thought it was adorable. It's pretty simple, but I just, I liked it. It's unique and different. And thankfully it really wasn't too much. $6.99. The thing I love the most is that it is microwave and dishwasher safe. We do hand wash our items, but it's always nice when you can find like food safe, easy to use bowls for those who do want to. And occasionally like it's nice to have microwavable dishes. And it does have the ghosts all the way around the edges as well. And then from that same collection, they had this Bats, and it was adorable. This is a larger bowl than the previous one. Same company, the Coco and Lola. And this was $9.99, and same thing, it's dishwasher and microwave safe, which is awesome. And again, we got the Bats all the way around the edges. Next, I really tried to make a set out of this, and they did not have everything, but they had pretty much everything. We've got the Ray Dunn Witch's Brew like the sign, but this time in dishware. So it's got the cute little cauldron on here, says Witch's Brew, and this one has little bats over it. It is only on the one side though. And this ended up being $6.99, and again, I love that it's dishwasher safe, microwave safe, it's always nice when you get that in dishware. Then we have a small plate, again, that same design. This was $5.99. Then they had a much larger plate, but again, that same exact design, which I just thought was adorable. And this was only $7.99. The two bowls that I showed you earlier are still pretty big for like a serving bowl, but they didn't have anything else. That was all they had in stock. This is the second time I've gone, and they do change their stock often. We've gone the two times, and each time it's been completely different. There's been no repeats as of yet. Unfortunately, I didn't get any matching bowls or ones that are really small, so this was the best I could come up with for a bowl. So this is a brie cheese baker. Probably not gonna cook that as of currently. I don't think I have any recipes for that. I just thought this was a really cute little bowl. Now it comes with a wooden spoon and it has this very adorable little pumpkin on top, but it's just the perfect little size for serving soups and stuff. Now on here, it doesn't really say one way or the other if it's microwave safe or oven safe or anything like that. Mostly I'm just using this as a bowl and this was $12.99. And then the very last thing that I've gotten is this beautiful wine cup. It's a little raven on top of a metal skull. This was $12.99. Now obviously with metal, it's don't put it in the microwave, that's a given. This is more for like the specialty drinks that I'll be cooking. So here is my first haul for Halloween 2022. If you saw any of the items that you would like to get yourself, do make sure to run over to a Home Goods or TJ Maxx as quickly as possible. They do sell out very quick. And like I said before, they do change their inventory very often. So if you see something you like, you probably want to grab it. And so that is going to be it for this haul video today. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm going to be posting every Friday for the month of August. We are going to be starting on all of the recipes from this little cookbook. So make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any of those uploads. And until next time, stay spooky.